name is Dr. Samantha Smith. I am a home health physical therapist that specializes in knee replacement. So first, just want to mention my Facebook group. I always mention it in the beginning of the videos now because I realize some people don't get to the end of my videos. So I don't want you to miss out on um, my Facebook group. It's so, so helpful. Um, there's a lot of people in the group who have gone through the surgery. So there's people you can kind of relate to and realize, oh, hey, my, my knee is normal. I my symptoms are just the same as, you know, 900 other people who have said the same thing. So really helpful. I'm going to link it in the description below. And then secondly, I do have a, um, a website available for anybody interested in really detailed blog posts written by me about really common questions. So you can visit succeedcourses.com. So the topic of this video today is what are normal symptoms between six and nine months post-surgery? So at this point, you should be pretty satisfied with your, um, your surgery. You should have way less pain than you did, let's say three months ago. And your pain should be, or your discomfort should be much, much different also than it was three months ago. And also your knee should be much, much better than your old arthritic knee. You should be, you know, way happier with, um, with this. So at, th at six to nine months post-surgery, the most common symptom is the stiffness and the achiness. And I noticed that the stiffness and the achiness for people at six to nine months post-surgery happens after a long day of activity. So let's say, you know, you're normally doing your daily routine and you don't really notice your knee quite, you know, quite that much throughout your daily routine. Maybe at the end of the day, you do have a little bit of stiffness and you have to elevate it, you know, every so often, maybe once or twice a week. But after a long day of activity, let's say you went to like a Christmas party or you went to um, a wedding or something like that where you're standing for four to five hours, if you're not used to doing that, at six to nine months post-surgery, you are going to feel the effects um, of standing for four to five hours. So even me, um, you know, I don't go to graduation parties every day. I don't stand for four to five hours at a time. Um, so even me, I haven't had a knee replacement and my knees would also be sore. My feet would be sore. I would even probably have a little bit of swelling in, in my feet and I'm 32 years old and haven't had a knee replacement. So just for anybody, um, doing something that's a long activity that you're not used to is going to make you sore. Another thing I notice is when people go on vacations, um, you're doing a lot more walking. You're, you're going, going, going all day on a vacation. And that is a really common time where people are like, whoa, my knee is really uncomfortable. It's stiff. It's aching now. Is there something wrong? And no, there usually is nothing wrong. It's just that increased activity level um, makes you really, really sore. So at six to nine months, those are the most common symptoms. It's just the stiffness, the achiness after a long day of activity. Um, it, it'll go away um, as your body continues to heal. At six to nine months, you should be about 90% healed. You're not at 100% quite yet. When you reach that 12-month mark, you're at that 100% um, healed. Your body has done all its inflammatory processes and it's it's healed completely. So. Give yourself some time at this point. I know that is the worst answer. I know people hate hearing that. They're like, I don't want to wait. I just want it to be better. This is six to nine months. That's so long. And it is a really long time. But just remember, you got a foreign object placed in your body. And now your body is like, what the heck is this? And you had also your bone removed. You had ligaments removed. You had tissue removed. You had muscles cut and sewn back together. There's a lot of healing that goes on with a knee replacement, more so than any other surgery, honestly. So there is a lot of healing to be done um, and it takes a very, very long time. So if you have any questions, please ask them below in the description and also please join the Facebook group. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you again next time.